Okay, yeah, I love this. We've got two different scales that are balanced, and then we've got a third scale that is not balanced, and we're going to figure out why. Is the left side too much? Is the right side too much? Whatever. I can see right off the bat, okay, right side of the scale here, two circles balance out, match up with left side of the scale, three triangles and two squares. Now, I love symbolic algebra as much as the next guy, probably more, quite honestly, but I want you to resist the urge to set up an equation here, like 3t plus 2q, q for square, of course, equals 2c, or something like that. Let's stay away from the symbols for just a second. Instead, here's what I notice. Both of these first two scales are in balance, and in the second scale, I've got triangle plus two squares on the left match up with triangle plus circle on the right. Now, triangle and triangle, we can ignore those. It must be the case that they match up with each other already, so really I'm just looking at a situation situation where a single circle on the right balances with two squares on the left. So coming back up to this first scale, I can see circle on the right and two squares on the left. And now that I know those balance each other out, I'm actually going to ignore them. And so I have several different equivalencies right now. A single circle is the same as two squares, but also a single circle is the same as three triangles. So I could furthermore conclude that two squares weigh the same as three triangles. So what does that tell me for this third scale? Well, first of all, clearly the circle is balancing with a circle. So I'm going to ignore those two circles. And just as clearly, a square balances with one of those three squares on the right. So I'm going to ignore those also. But what I have left over on the right is two squares, which a moment ago we said, based on the fact that two squares are the same as a circle and three triangles are the same as a circle, those two squares need to be matched up with three triangles triangles on the left here, not just one, which must tell me that the right side of that scale is heavier than the left side. And so, of course, I want to go ahead and select the right side and let's check our work. How did we do? Yes! Plus 15. One lesson complete. That is Brilliant.org, my friends. I would love for you to check them out. Link in the description. Brilliant.org is sponsoring Polymathematic this week, and you can get 20% off a Brilliant Premium account if you sign up right now. And probably within the next few days, but I don't know when you're watching this video.